up guys? Today I'm going to be taking you through how to do a back roll off the water on cable. Wow! No! Oh! I was so dry! God damn it. What is up guys? Today I'm going to be taking you through how to do a back roll on a cable. So for the back roll, the main things to focus on are really having those arms in strong and locked at your hip. The moment you let those arms come out, that's when you're going to feel that back roll stall on you. The next thing we're going to focus on is having about a two second cut and really trying to load that edge up. It doesn't have to be quite as hard a cut as the Rayleigh and slightly shorter than the Rayleigh edge as well. The reason for this is we're really trying to use that edge to boost you up and over into the back roll. So on your first lap round, I would do a two second practice cut to really feel out that edge. When you feel ready to try the back roll, we're going to set ourselves up about halfway along the final two towers. Keep those arms in strong, two second cut, and scoop with that front foot to help you rotate over. So similar to the Rayleigh, when you throw that back roll, you're really trying to scoop and rotate over using that front foot. The difference with the back roll is instead of releasing the board behind you, we're gonna try and scoop and drive that board up and over into this back roll motion. So my top tips, once you've got that release on the back roll, is really trying to drive the board over as fast and as hard as possible. So we have our two second edge, hard scoop, up and over. And as you're bringing that back roll around, you're really trying to spot that landing so you can figure out where you are in the air and be ready to bend your knees as you come down. For the back roll, you're really trying to do this one with two hands on and use all your strength to glue that handle at your front hip. This means you're gonna rotate over fast and not feel yourself stalling out in the air. If you're struggling to get your edge locked in on this, I would suggest trying some practice cuts and really focusing on whether you have your weight too much on your front foot or too much on your back foot, as this can really affect how that back roll releases off the water. Once you've managed to land your first back roll, you can start to work towards a roll to revert off the water, which is where we keep that handle in strong, we release for the back roll, and move the handle towards your back hip. This is going to allow you to rotate a front side 180 midway through that back roll. So there we have it, how to do your first back roll on cable. Hopefully that has given you guys a few helpful tips and tricks. They definitely helped me when I was learning. It might just help you overcome that block that you have on this trick. If you enjoyed this video, please give us a thumbs up and leave us a comment down below to let us know how you're getting on with your back rolls. We've got plenty more videos and tutorials coming your way this year. So don't forget to subscribe and we will see you in the next video. Peace.